So in today's lesson, I'm going to add a Windows Server by WMI protocol. So here we can see the devices. Actually, I turned off VMware ESXi and some of the Windows servers. So here, an Active Directory, let's say Manage Node, and actually we added Active Directory, let's say Edit Properties. So and let's say cancel and let's actually delete this item, which is Active Directory. So that's great. And we'll add a node. This time we're going to add it by WMI protocol. That's great. So here we'll say WMI and ICMP and here as we can see the pop-up actually tells you you can monitor server application by SAM which is server application monitor that's good we'll say no thanks and here this is my domain credential which we added before in previous lessons and here you can add whatever server that join it to Active Directory with this credential if you don't have you can easily type the credential for example your domain domain something like lab or whatever the username and password and we'll say test actually this credential will store on the credential section so we'll say my domain and here we'll say test and as you can see the test passed successfully next so you may ask what a difference between the WMI and SNMP for Windows actually it depends on the choose resources here and polling. With SNMP, you can deeply monitor whatever devices that support SNMP. But here, as you can see, the resource pool here, just CPU and physical memory and virtual memory and disks. We don't have something like interfaces or things like that we have the lessons the difference between snmp and wmi i will tell you on that lesson actually i will compare for example this active directory which will add it with the wmi i will compare this active directory with another server that actually added by snmp protocol so we'll say next and we we'll scroll down we'll say add a node so this is how you can easily actually add your devices here by wmi